Uh, this is Mark from Shumway Construction, and today I'm going to be replacing this door with a new door, an arch top uh, door, paint grade door, and I'm going to be replacing the door and the jam and the casing, and I'll show you how to do that right now. Today, right now I'm going to take out the old door. I cut, free up the casing away from the wall with a utility knife. I do this because I don't want to damage the drywall by pulling it away because there might be some paint that pulls it away. Now I'm going to take my mini reciprocating saw and I'm going to cut the nails so I can pull the jam out. You just want to be careful you don't cut the, the floor. And now the jam should just pull out. Really slick. <laughs> I'm just going to break this apart. So it's easier to haul out. nails left I'm going to go ahead and pull them out on both sides now we're ready to take the straps off here and set the door uh, one thing I didn't ch I didn't tell you that I'm going to now is that you want to make sure of your measurements. You want to make sure you buy the correct door for your opening before you start tearing it out. And I did. This is the correct size, but that is something to uh, take note of to make sure that when you go to pick it up, you are buying the correct size. And we could have we could have kept, um, and I might keep that door and see if somebody wants it or take it to restore, but. Uh, these doors, this, this house used to have carpet in it. The doors were cut really high, so there was about an inch and a half gap. So I may just scrap the door. But anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and start getting this unstrapped and get ready to set it. This is a split jam, a split jam door. 
and I'll show you that here. And, and that means that this jam will actually split apart and go in both ways. Uh, you can buy jams at a door shop and they come without the trim on them. And this jam is made in one piece, like I took, just like I took out. This is a different style. I picked this up at Home Depot. It, I, I really kind of, I really like this, this, uh, this style. It's a split jam. Uh, it's very easy to install uh, and it'll go virtually any width opening that you have up to uh, five inches from four and a half to five inches. So it's a very versatile uh, jam, very easy to install. And what you're going to have to do is take out these staples that hold the, the, two, the two halves together. They need to be removed. And this, this is one side right here. We'll take out this little piece. This this, this just keeps the door from coming out, so you have to take it off. It keeps the door from opening up. It's a shipping. They put this in there just for shipping purposes, but it's trash. And you'll we'll just set our door in our opening. It all fits good. Okay, this you have you have play on this door, so I'm I'm going to make sure both sides are flat on the floor, and then I make sure that the top is lined up so the door isn't touching up on the top. That's good. And then you start by just tacking in the corners. And that's basically going to hold the door. And then we just start down the side and shooting it in at the hinge points. All right, that's this side. That's this side's put in. And then this side, this is the other side. And this side has a, this part will fit right inside this groove of the, of the other existing jam, the, the other side of the jam. It'll fit right inside that groove and that's what finishes it off. So you're just gonna line these up at the bottom, slip them in, it slides right in into place and you take and we're going to nail those off on the top as well And that's it.
We're just going to caulk it up, fill the nail holes, and paint it. And I'll put the knob back on. There are other ways to, to have done this. We could have, I could have bought a, uh, a jam that was the full width jam that I had would have had to shoot the trim on after I set the door. But again, this, this was just a much easier, much simpler way to do it. These split jams uh, make it very, very simple, very easy to do. And uh, it's something that virtually anybody could do as long as they have a nail gun and uh, a means to cut the nails to cut the old jam out. And if you don't, then just take a hammer and break them or a pry bar and break them out and pull the nails out that don't come out with a when, when you're pulling the jam. But otherwise, it's a very easy job, very minimal dust. And anyway, I hope you like this video. And if you do, hit the subscribe button and I'll get you to more as they come up. Thanks for watching. That's it. Oh, do you want a song and a dance now? <laughs> Sorry, I just do doors. <laughs>